The repair shop welcomes all manner of historical items for specialist attention. And today sees another example. Meteorology and climate student Ollie Millen has brought a scientific curio for mechanical whiz Steve Fletcher. Hello. Hi. I'm Steve. Hi, I'm Ollie. Nice to meet you. Hi. Pop uh, your box on there. What have we got? Um, it's a uh, Richard Frere's barograph. All right. The barograph is a Victorian instrument that predicts the weather by measuring the air pressure in the atmosphere, a barometer that draws a graph. My uncle gave it to me, and he received it uh, from an elderly lady whose late husband um, was really interested in meteorology. And, of course, she thought that he would give it to, to me because she wanted it to go to someone who was really interested in yeah. it as well. And, obviously, I study it. Um, my granddad uh, is really interested in it as well. Have you always been interested in weather? Yeah, from quite a young age. Um, it's uh, extreme events and all that sort of thing, so snow, heavy snowfalls. And from very small, I've always loved thunderstorms and, and things like yeah. that. People think I'm crazy, but I, I love it, yeah. So this, this uh, rotates once a week, and the atmospheric pressure actually alters the, the pressure um, inside, and that moves this arm here, which has the uh, nib on the end, and that just goes up and down. They are really good fun, and you, you're right, when you get the extremes happen, uh, like the storm of 87. Yes. Um, I had one in my workshop at that time, yeah. and, and it drew a, a line straight down the graph. Yeah, yeah, straight. Uh, it's an amazing event. Yeah, huge drop, yeah. So it's, it's good to record those events. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. It's a really nice um, quality piece. And, and what would you like me to do uh, with it apart from get it going. Would, would you like it all cleaned up? Uh, yeah, that would be great. Yeah, fantastic. That would be brilliant, cos I know it has some marks on it in some places and maybe some of the, the woodwork's bashed. OK, I think that's, uh, that's a job for Will to do. I'll do the mechanics yeah. and he can do the woodwork, I think. OK. Well, I look forward to um, getting this all sparkling and, and working well for you so that you can keep it in the future and, and, and enjoy uh, watching the weather. That would be brilliant. Thank you very much. Right, thank you very thank much. Thank you, thanks. Bye-bye. Right. Bye-bye now. Well, the barograph is quite a treasured possession and quite a special item. It'd be really, really fantastic to see it, see it all working again. This is a real neat little barograph, actually. A uh, well-made piece and um, around about 120 years old. It's probably never been a part in its life. Maybe the, the clock mechanism has, but I don't think the rest of it's been apart. It's lovely that, that the original um, ink bottle is still there. The barograph may not tell the time, but the paper-covered barrel is turned by a clockwork mechanism. The movement should just pop out nicely. There we are. It's absolutely filthy dirty in there and obviously needs a, a thorough good clean. It's going to be a lovely piece again. Ollie's, Ollie should be very, very proud of having this. Nice thing for, for someone that actually works um, with the weather um, to, to own.